Hi everyone, this is Lisa Sylvester. And this is Mark Sylvester. And we're going to show you exactly how you can create your own visual content for your website, blog, social media, advertising, and any other graphic you need for your online business. Mark and I are here to make creating graphics as simple and painless as possible. Exactly. And using the web graphics creator, it's super fun and super easy to use. So let's just jump in and let me show you how it all works. When you enter the website, you'll have access to all of these awesome design sets. And to start the app, all you have to do is click on one of the uh, icons here. And we're gonna go to the social media set first. You can scroll down and look for a template that looks good to you, like, like this one. Everything in the templates are editable and you can resize the text and change the font. So let's quickly change the text by double clicking on it. And of course, we don't need a strawberry for our travel tip. So we're going to take this and delete it. And we're going to come up here to the new photos feature that we've installed for you. And we're going to search for travel. And we're going to find a nice picture of a beach or a mountain or whatever our blog article is about. There you go. That's good. Bring it over, slide it onto the canvas, and we can make it big. Drop it right about here and let's send it to the back so we can see the text and bam, there you go. And now let's take a look at our awesome new text feature. Click on our text and come over here to the text format and we have 880 Google fonts installed. So to preview these 880 fonts, click on the preview button and let's find a nice font that we like. Let's just say we like Alpha Slab 1. And we'll just come over here to the Google fonts menu and start typing Alpha Slab. And as soon as we start typing, that particular font will show up and all we have to do is click on it. And there you go. Let's make another sized graphic for another social media site. So I'm gonna come over here to select designs. And right now I'm not gonna save this, but there is a save feature under file. And we've made uh, video tutorials on how to save your graphics and sort them out. So I'm gonna discard the changes for now. And we're gonna come back here to the, uh, to the home page. And you'll notice up here we have other sizes in the social media set. So we can click on the Facebook share size and we'll get some templates. So you'll see all the templates that you get. So I just select another template and let's change some of the uh, text in it. And now we need a few more graphics. So this one's fine. Let's get some more. Let's come up here to elements now and we're going to go see that we have a whole bunch of really cool graphics that you can use for your design. So we have comic elements. Let's look at some design elements here. And we have arrows. There are cool special effects. Let's bring some fire over onto it. <laughs> kind of cool, but we don't need that. Uh, let's come up here and we're going to find, um, let's find some social media elements here. If I click on this folder. We'll have a couple of badges. Let's just say this is for our Facebook page. So let's shrink that up, put it on the bottom. Let's get rid of that here. There, a cool little signature. All right, now let's just say we don't particularly want this uh, graphic. We can delete it. Make sure, there we go, this is cool. Bam, bring that in and make it bigger and we'll send it to the back so we can see our text. Ah, here's a better picture. Cool, and here's a cool feature. We also have video motion elements. Come back over here to elements, and now we're gonna go to motion video elements. So we click on it. Now, we're gonna be populating this, this uh, area. This video is a little bit before we release the software, so once we release the software, we're gonna have more, uh, more motion backgrounds for you to choose from. But let's find a good one like, like, let's try this. Now these are video elements, so I'm going to bring it over. And I can bring this to the back. And this picture, if I wanted to, let's, let's just close this out for a second. Click on the picture, go to image format, and fade it down a little bit. And you'll see the graphics in the background moving. Now that's not working too good for me, so let's delete the graphic go back to elements and find the motion backgrounds again and let's find one like this let's see what this looks like all right that will get people's attention if they're on Facebook scrolling their feed and send it to the back great okay now this square 
if we wanted to colorize it, we could we could uh, close out the graphics here, and let's go to image color, and we're going to colorize this. There, how's that? Cool. There is our new Facebook graphic, and now when we click on a video element, this menu changes to, to provide some video recording tools. So there is another tutorial. I'm not going to show you this real quick on this walkthrough video, but basically you hit the video record button and record the video, and then you can post it on your Facebook page. And there you go. And when people are scrolling, they'll see it and they'll go, whoa, what is that? <laughs> okay, then we have some really cool template sets like the text effects template set. You'll come to the text effects. These make like great page titles, page headers. So for example, we can click on snow and you can type somebody's name in. Bam, save that picture. We'll find something like this one. Double click it and we can type in like buy now. Or you can make some really cool things like And you can put this up on your website and make a, a little coupon for it or something underneath. And you can always import your own graphics too. So for example, let's go to the marketing graphics. And now we don't need, we don't want this uh, brick background. We want to import our own image. So let's go to the file menu, import your own image. <laughs> there you it's go. Pretty awesome. We've got over 900 templates to choose from and to modify and to play with and there's thousands of elements, and you can import your own graphics, and you can even upload your own video elements if you have them. So get ready to create some amazing graphics and animations with the Web Graphics Creator by Laughing Bird Software.